learned how to tune pianos in the summer of 1962. And he's been honing his craft for the past 51 years. Yeah, Lance is here now with the story. Lance. Thanks, guys. Even at 76 years of age, Norman Doherty is still working full time in and around Lincoln and is widely known as one of the best piano tuners in southeast Nebraska. That in and of itself is pretty impressive. But on top of that, this guy is a one of a kind human being and one of the most memorable men I've ever met. Yeah, piano tuning can be a high strung job. At first, Norman Doherty grabs your attention with his wry sense of humor. If I get tired of piano tuning, I think I'll take up psychiatry so I can still work with tension. Then he impresses you with his tuning knowledge. I'm on an F right now. You could say he has a great ear, and he needs it, because he's tuned hundreds of pianos over the past half century without the gift of sight. It's called retinitis pigmentosa. A condition that both of his siblings were also born with. You have many black flecks over your retina, and each one of those is a blind spot. Norman attended the Nebraska School for the Blind in Nebraska City. I began taking piano lessons. Many years later, Norman was at a seminary studying to be a pastor when he learned how to tune pianos. It's kind of fun. And there's a satisfaction in having something work better when you finish than when you started. Two flats on a piano are okay, but two flats on a car are terrible. Norman lives by himself, and over the past five decades, he's ridden many buses and walked who knows how many miles, making house call after house call. I can cross Oak Street here, get out in the middle of 13th Street by accident, and people enjoy pointing me to the curb, so they, they, they like to tell me where to go. Norman was married for 37 years and had four kids with normal vision. I'm 16 years a widower now. And my younger son says one time mom had a blind date and look what happened to her. Keith Heckman of Dietz Music House has been subcontracting Norman for 40 years. First thing you should know is that he doesn't have a challenge. You and I have the challenge. We can see. He, he thinks we're challenged. Some people in middle age or so go blind and they sit down. Some other people are so daring that start the daylights out of you. So. I admire the daring ones as well, and while I have met some pretty incredible people in my life, I've never met anyone more daring than Mr. Doherty. What an excellent example he provides of living life to its fullest. And check this out, back in the 1970s, Norman did some of his best work right in this very studio, as he tuned the mm -hmm. cartoon chorale piano for Calamity Kate and Silent Orb. Some great memories there. Who knew? What an impressive Fantastic. guy. Amazing man, and he is still working hard. And if you'd like to get your piano tuned, he'd love to come out and see you. It's back in Wisconsin. That might be a problem. Okay. Well, <laughs> he makes road trips. All right, thanks, Leah. <laughs> we'll update your forecast next.